Okay, so we're about to uh, head back and see uh, what kind of fucking bullshit I have to deal with today. You know? Like, it's funny, like, people think being homeless is fucking, like, easy or something, but you sit around and fucking drink beer or some shit. No, every single fucking day is, like, a full-time job. I work harder fucking now than I have ever in my life. Because it takes five miles to fucking go check my mail, do laundry, fucking clean shit off of me. Literally. Um, and that's just one way. That's ten miles. And then the, how many hours is that? Ugh. I don't know if there's anything else I have to do. What else is that, you know? So, here we're about to go down that hill. Let's see. They posted a yellow warning sign on there or not. Which I know they did, but. This is how they came. Actually, let's go sneak down around there and see if I can see those people cleaning up Matt's fucking tent. Yeah, I can see their tracks. I'm an expert tracker. Okay, so somewhere over there. Oh, and they left this way too. My defense is over there. Too strong. Just let us sneak over there. Let's see what happens over there. Although the mess is pretty small, so they probably already just picked it up and fucking walked off. Parks and Recs camera footage here. If you ever watch Parks and Recs, it looks like there's a fucking creepy stalker because they always catch some part of the <laughs> door building, you know, corner of wall or whatever, 
always is in the foreground. Just always catch like somebody's just creeping around if you're first person view. Let's see. So far. This fucking tent's still there, it looks like. So I don't know who the fucking dudes in the orange vest were. 